The following contest is a Fatal 4-Way Extreme Rules match and is for the WWE United Kingdom Championship. Introducing the challenger from Hackensack, New Jersey, weighing in at two pounds, X.O. Amir E. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. And introducing the champion from Auckland, New Zealand, weighing in at 194 pounds. He is the WWE United Kingdom Champion, the Reaper. The champ comes into his title defense incredibly competent, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. And it seems to me like the champ is eager for the opening bell to sound. Yeah, he's clearly itching to get this match underway, as is this capacity crowd. And introducing the challenger from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 100. Ray! Championship action coming up next, guys, and this one promises to be absolutely amazing. I completely agree, Cole, especially considering who's involved in this match and what's at stake. Without a doubt, a big opportunity for him here tonight, Byron. Yeah, it really is, Michael. And he doesn't seem like the type of guy who's just going to squander an opportunity like this. I expect to see him push the champ to the limit here tonight. And introducing the challenger from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 216 pounds, John Morrison. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. But, Corey, is it a fair question whether or not he's ready for a match of this magnitude? Yeah, I think that's fair, Cole. Listen, anytime you head into a match as the underdog, especially a title match, there's going to be some doubt that creeps into your head. It's just human nature. The WWE United Kingdom Championship quickly developing a specific brand of competition, a hard-hitting, strong style. Expect fists to faces in this one, fellas. 
want to know how important the United Kingdom title is, just look at its history. The first champion was decided in a 16-man tournament featuring Europe's best competitors. And after that, we saw Pete Dunne hold the title for 685 days with dozens of high-profile defenses. We'll see if that prestige continues with tonight's title match. Not looking good, guys. He's definitely being the aggressor here. Things are playing out exactly how he envisioned. Close line. So effective. Oh, my goodness. Crushing it. Ooh, what impact. Perhaps feeling a little more comfortable on the outside at this point. And he's heading back in. Nice drop kick. Oh, so ruthless. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. Wicked body shot. Reversal! What a counter! Spiked into the ring apron. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My in ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. This could mean trouble. Neckbreaker. Ouch. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many times we've seen Extreme Rules matches result in broken bones, stitches, and even trips to a medical facility. Yeah, but despite all those inherent dangers, these superstars still willingly sign up for Extreme Rules matches. That's what amazes me the most. Look at this. In a fatal four-way, Corey's strategy is so important. Yeah, the combatants must be aware that they can find themselves in somewhat of a handicap match if alliances form. It could be a two-on-one or a three-on-one situation. Any way you look at it, this match is an uphill battle. Oh, an elbow drop! Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Look out here. He's got something cooking. Oh, look at this. It's like they're harnessing the entire power of the WWE Universe. This is not going to end well for their opponent. This is insane. Boom! Oh. Hey, old punch. What are we going to see here? They have to fight another day. The Fatal 4-Way match works like this. Four superstars are in the ring all at once. There are no count outs and no disqualifications. You have four superstars who are throwing down in the ring all at the same time, and they can fight. Oh, here it comes! Standing Spanish foot. Cover by the champ! And he breaks up the pinfall. where things can get ugly in an instant. Bringing it back into the ring. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Boom, what impact. Uh oh, cool throw. Whoa! Oh, 
Unreal. A back suplex. Watch this. He's in full control now. I think we know what's coming next in the wheelhouse. A champion. And shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE United Kingdom Champion, The Reaper. And he picks up the win.